My dad named the puppy dog he brought home Blackie. Common in Piedras Negras for black dogs. I called him René. So playful, loving, rolling around on the leaves. We quickly understood each other. We'd follow each other around. Míralos, my mother would say. That dog follows him everywhere. We have to hold him when he goes to school. Then on that Saturday, René was six weeks old, tall and beautiful and strong. My grandma, Camila, came over with a homemade lemon meringue pie. My René just jumped in fear for some reason. Grandma scared my doggy, getting mad. He barked out loud, grabbed her leg in his hocico, blood spurting out right away. My abuelita crying, and so was I. My papa pulled René, locked ourselves in my room, the one I shared with my older brother, Hector Ruiz. Papa took Granny to the hospital. Tetanus shot. A report was written. Blackie had no shots. He was a puppy, but he had to die. Murdered to prove he was all right. Everyone afraid of rabies. Not I. I didn't understand. It also seems so far away now. Two men in green jumpers in a white Chevy truck placed a pointed spiked collar on my René Black. Choking him until he died. Placing his limp body inside a see-through metal cage. Cruel. Painful. So evil. And how I cried. René was howling. And so was I. <laughs>